Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. I wanted to start this video by saying thank you to everybody who gave me such kind words and support on my first video. It really got me motivated to put up more. And to everybody who gave me suggestions, I really do appreciate it, you guys. You don't know how much it means to me. So I'm very thankful for that. Thank you. As you guys can already tell by the title, these are my July favorites. Most of these are items that I purchased last month that I have really come to enjoy and I figured were worth mentioning. I know we are a week into August already. I cannot believe how fast time is flying by, but we're here, so let's get it started. So the first favorite I wanted to talk about is a book. It's called Skin Cleanse by Adina Grigger. Looks like this. Adina Grigger is the founder of the SW Basics of Brooklyn organic skincare line that's available at Target. In the book, Grigger guides you through a holistic program to heal your skin from the inside out. It starts with all the basics of full body health like eating plenty of fresh whole foods, getting plenty of exercise, drinking plenty of water, and getting enough rest. She also busts myths about cosmetics that had me like. No, I'm kidding. I don't believe it's Gregor's mission to have you go cold turkey on the things that you love, but rather you not need them anymore. In the book, she challenges you to a 24-hour skin cleanse in which you don't use any products for a whole day. And then she helps you slowly reintroduce some of them back and even helps you make products of your own with ingredients that you can find in your own kitchen, which I think was so awesome. Um, so if you're looking to be more minimal and mindful about your skincare, I really do suggest reading this book. Uh, you can find it at Amazon or the SW Basics of Brooklyn website. So that's Skin Cleanse by Adina Grigger. This next item is activity based. Ever since my son has come along, my husband and I have really cut down on TV and video games. So I really like having activities like this one to keep me busy, but they don't require too much commitment. So if my son wants to go from stacking blocks to throwing them, I intervene immediately. Um, this is the Calm coloring book and it looks like this. It's got pretty cool designs and pictures in here that you just color. Um, I really love that it's soothing and it really gets my creativity juices flowing. Um, I really like coloring and just like listening to podcasts or reading books um, while my son is playing or while I'm cooking. So I really like having activities like this for those times. Moving right along. So the next favorite and probably all of July favorite is sunscreen. I use the Bare Republic Natural Mineral Sunscreen and it looks like this. I don't buy anything higher than a factor of 30 for me and my family. The increase in UV protection is relatively small compared to anything higher than that and it's been proven that sunscreens with the higher SPF of 30 require more sun filtering chemicals, chemicals like oxybenzone that can cause tissue damage, um, hormone disruption and low birth weight in daughters so it's doing more harm than good essentially i don't claim to be an expert on this obviously do your own research this is just something that i take into account when buying sunscreens i really do love this one in particular because it is for the face and um, i use sunscreen every day and even in the winter um, because I'm crazy about sun stuff like that. I also avoid being in the sun for long periods of time between 11 and 2 when the sun is hitting the hardest. Um, this one though really does absorb into my skin so quickly and it doesn't leave that oily feeling. Um, I can put my makeup over this and my makeup isn't going anywhere. It does not have primer capabilities. I'm just saying it doesn't have that oily feeling like other sunscreens where like if you're to put your makeup on over them, your makeup just kind of like brushes off. No, this one absorbs really well and it is oxybenzone free. You can find lots of oxybenzone free products at Target. I believe Alba and the Neutrogena Purin Free Baby are oxybenzone free. Um, I really do think it's important that you go out and get your daily dose of vitamin D, but also be very mindful of what the sun is doing to your skin. So that's why sunscreen has been such a huge favorite this summer. I make sure that my family is always lathered up. So love this try it so this next item is food based it's called pirate's booty uh, you can find this at target and i believe you can find it at costco also but they are rice corn puffs um, and they come in an aged white cheddar flavor 
I really like these because I feel like they are a healthier alternative to reaching to like a cookie or chips. Um, my husband and my son, sorry my phone's going off. My husband and my son really love this so I figured it was worth mentioning with you guys. They also have other flavors, crunchy treasures, veggie, fruit booty, and sour cream and onion. So try it and love it. You're going to fall in love, I promise. Calling me. These next two items are style based. I found both of these at Target and if you follow me on Facebook and Instagram you know that I've been wearing these a lot lately. I'm obsessed. Uh, the first one is this top. I really love it. It is so me. I feel like I can wear this during the fall and the winter. I am looking for a huge chunky necklace to wear with it so if you have any ideas for it uh, put the link down below or tell me where to go where I can find one. So I really love the top. I also really love these sunglasses. They do have UV protection, which is something that I always look for in sunglasses if they don't have UV protection. Like, what's the point really, right? But I really love these because I just feel like they're so stylish and so fetch. Like, I mean, look at this. Look how cool I look. Stunning. Mmm, mmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Alright guys, so we've reached the last item on my favorites list. We have had this product for quite some time, but if you watched my staples video, you know that I really love the Toms of Maine Toddler Toothpaste, but I didn't mention the toothbrushes we were using, so I figured I could share those with you guys today. So before I let Danny brush his own teeth, I do go in with a flosser like this. I know that they do have some that have a rounded tip, um, but I really like carrying these in my purse for when we go out to eat at restaurants, so I really like that they have the pig part. So when I go to the store, I'm not buying two items, I'm just buying one. But um, what I do is I cover the, sh the sharp part with my hand like this, and then I go in and floss his teeth. So after we're done flossing, I go in with a toddler toothbrush. This is the Coldgate Soft Bristled uh, Toddler Brush. I really like that it's got the short bristles on it, so I'm not doing any damage to his gums when I am brushing. Um, I really love this for days that we eat pastas or really sticky carbohydrates. I really do think that this is doing all the job in getting his teeth cleaned. After I'm done brushing Danny's teeth, I let him go in with the Baby Banana Toddler Toothbrush. Looks like this. Um, it is BPA latex phthalate and lead free. It's made of 100% food grade silicone. It's easy to grasp, dishwasher, and freezer friendly. Um, I really like that it's flexible. Um, Danny really loves brushing his teeth with this. This is the second one that we've owned. We upgraded to this design from the banana uh, teether. I don't have mine anymore, but I will insert a picture here. So I really do love having this one so he can practice brushing his own teeth, although I don't think it's thorough, which is why we go in with the Colgate brush. But um, this is a great tool to use to have them be a little bit more dependent when it comes to his oral hygiene. So that is all for my July favorites. I hope to hear what some of your favorites are and what you think about the products that I mentioned today. Thank you so much for watching and I'll be seeing you guys soon. Bye!